Tiffany Haddish got jokes. Social media believes Tiffany Haddish is trolling Common and Jennifer Hudson over their relationship. A TikTok user commented under one of Tiffany's videos and said, I'm still waiting to see if Common gave you the earrings I gave him for you when he came to Charlotte, the fan wrote. Girl, he never gave me no damn earring. He probably gave us to Jennifer. We previously reported back in 2021 that Common and Haddish had ended their one-year relationship. A source for the estranged couple claimed the two were never in the same city together and both of them are just too busy for a serious relationship. Tiffany did express that she was disappointed in the way Common handled the breakup. He might be the type of person that never really settles with somebody. Maybe he's like, you know, like a bee going from flower to flower to flower. I don't know. I wish him nothing but joy and happiness, you know. He will always be cool. In a charming moment on Hudson's daytime talk show, Common and Jennifer Hudson announced their relationship as official. In a forthcoming interview that will air in full on The Jennifer Hudson Show on Monday, Common and Jennifer Hudson acknowledged their connection. After over two years of speculating about whether or not they are dating, the news is released. On Sunday, Hudson posted a preview of the interview to Instagram. Now we gotta get down to business, Mr. Common. Mm -hmm. I'm a host. Hudson jokes in the clip. And so I have to ask you this question, because everybody always want to know this. Are you dating anyone? From there, Common responds. So, yes, I'm in a relationship that is one of the most beautiful people I've ever met in life. She's smart. She loves God. She has something real down to earth about her. But I set my standard kind of high because she had to have an EGOT. She had to win an Oscar on her first movie. I set my stand high. She had to get her own talk show. When Hudson posted the video to Instagram, she said that viewers will be able to hear her reply to the comments on Monday when the episode premieres. In a further teaser, Common says as reported by People, this relationship is a happy place for me. Seeing her happy actually makes me really happy. So, I'm very grateful. I thank God each and every day, and I'm just letting God guide this relationship. Common and Jennifer Hudson were seen out on a date at Usher's Las Vegas residency. As it turned out, the confessions hitmaker even approached the couple at one point during the evening. The Atlanta native performed live on Friday, December 1st, staying true to his persona and addressing the crowd directly. He picked out Hudson and sang There Goes My Baby to her directly while she was enjoying the show with her almost confirmed love partner sitting next to her. <laughs> Couples have experienced their fair share of controversy over this regular portion of the 45-year-old show in recent months, but the Chicago MC remained calm while the R and B legend serenaded the Dreamgirls star. So Victoria Monet took a time to surprise Usher at his Las Vegas residency in a touching act of appreciation. A unique jacket was given to the icon Usher by the skilled on my mama hitmaker in honor of his impending halftime show at Super Bowl 58. The sincere friendship and respect that these two musical titans have for one another is evident in the poignant conversation captured on fan-produced video. Monet showed her admiration for Usher in the video, referring to him as one of the only remaining icons in the business. You see the culture in the building. Make some noise. In front of the enthusiastic crowd, she continued to applaud and honor him while highlighting the importance of his presence to culture. Monet sent Usher a personalized jacket as a thank you gift. It's a special memento that surely has sentimental significance for the Grammy Award winner. The audience cheered as they saw the unexpected present. It was a moment that demonstrated how much everyone appreciates Usher's ongoing influence on the music industry. Not only does Monet's kind gesture emphasize the camaraderie among artists, however, it also represents Usher's immense impact on the music business, which cuts across all genres and generations. The next day, Monet shared her thoughts on the amazing event on her Instagram feed. She also said how appreciative she was of the chance to honor a living legend. She thanked Usher for one of the greatest evenings of her life and called him a true class act in her message. With a focus on the happiness and optimism that Usher provides to the world via his ageless and boundless creativity, Monet's comments exude sincere admiration. The conversation between Usher and Victoria Monet demonstrates how intertwined the music industry is, where the efforts of other artists are honored and uplifted. The Super Bowl 58 halftime show featuring Usher is already expected to be a historic event, and Monet's kind gift gives the event even more significance. Other celebrities have been drawn to Usher's Las Vegas residency since it began earlier this year. Most famously, Kiki Palmer's outfit from the concert caused a stir on the internet when her boyfriend remarked on how suitable it was. Palmer eventually had to obtain a restraining order against Jackson in order to pursue sole custody of their child, which brought the drama to a much darker turn. Usher has become even more in demand ever since it was revealed that he will be the featured performer at the Super Bowl the following year. Dozens of prominent figures have appeared at performances before his stay ends next month. He has reportedly had visits from Summer Walker, Quavao, Kenya Moore, Young Miami, Doja Cat, and many more to watch him sing. The most recent addition to the list is Jane Almani, 
who recently appeared in a show that resulted in several viral videos. Usher gave Monty the royal treatment during the performance, serenading her and having a dance with her during a specific song. Fans react to their sultry on-stage interactions. His wife or girlfriend a good sport cause Babby, one of the top comments reads. Others pointed out how little Usher seems to care about any public drama that he ends up involved in. Usher just singing his heart away while people running his name through the mud. I need to be this level of unbothered, another top comment reads. The R&B icon will release a new album in tandem with his Super Bowl performance the following year. He released Good Good, one of his biggest singles in years, earlier this year. He collaborated with Summer Walker and 21 Savage on the song, which ultimately reached the top 30 on the Hot 100. That's it for today, thanks for watching. Tell us what you think in the comment section and most importantly subscribe. See you.